In the previous video, we covered an overview of the MesaCam Editor Performance Package. Now let's take a closer look at converting MesaTroll programs between different MesaAC controls. The MesaCam Editor Performance Package, Convert Between Control Kinds, is one of the key tools towards increasing the shop's productivity and profits. We are the only solution on the market that can convert all the way from T1 to the latest matrix or smart machine. For example, let's take an existing M32 program with typical drilling, tapping, and pocketing processes and convert it to the matrix M control. Here we see the original M32 program on the left and the converted program to matrix M on the right. When a customer has existing Mazak CNC's and has recently purchased a new machine, usually one big issue for them is how to run the existing Mazatrol programs to the new machine. So one benefit of Convert Between Control Kinds is that it can convert older programs to the newer controls. Now, MesaCam can just as easily convert a program to an earlier control. Let's take a Fusion 640M program and convert it to an M32 program. Here we see the original Fusion 640M program on the left and the converted M32 program on the right. MesaCam easily converted this program to an M32 program and even handled the conversion of the tornado milling function that isn't supported in the earlier M32 control by converting this process to a MesaTroll manual process. So another benefit of the MesaCam Editor Performance Package converting between control kinds is that it gives you the ability to move MesaTroll jobs from machine to machine without much effort and loss of time. Now let's take a look at converting a T32 program to the new smart control. Here again we can see that MesaCam converted the older T32 program to the newer smart control in a matter of seconds. How long do you think it would take for you to manually transfer this program? You would of course have to go to the T32 and copy the program by writing it down on paper and then take that paper and program it into the smart control. And by the way this program was relatively short. What if the program was several pages long? The MesaCam Editor Performance Package Convert Between Control Kinds feature is one of the key tools towards increasing productivity and profits. MesaCam can even convert earlier integrects such as T3, T32, T Plus, and Fusion to the newer Integrex Pro and Matrix, including the E, I, and J series machines. Let's take a look at converting an Integrex Mark II Fusion 640MT program to an E-Series Matrix E program. Many customers who buy the E-Series machine, which is milling based, also have an earlier Integrex, which is turning based. MesaCam converts between these entirely differently based control families. There are literally hundreds of tricky nuances that are handled in this extensive advanced conversion. So, the MesaCam Editor Performance Package can convert lathe, with the exception of T4, and mill MesaTroll programs throughout the generations of MesaAC controllers, including the latest smart control. There is no other product available that can convert to and from the smart control in an offline product. MesaCam can convert the earlier Integrex controls T3, T32, T Plus, and Fusion to the newer Integrex Pro and Matrix, including across machine families Mark 1, 2, 3, and 4 to the E, I, and J series machines. MesaCam can convert TPC from earlier controls T32, Fusion 640T, Fusion 640MT, and the Integrex Pro to the Matrix. Although the Mazak CNC usually has the ability to internally upconvert from one prior generation, when it does this for the Fusion to Matrix, I don't know if you are aware, it drops out TPC. And since TPC is where one puts the moves to avoid crashing, guess what happens if TPC is dropped out? MesaCam can also convert the process layout from earlier lays to Matrix priority number style and for the smart control. It is important to note that some controls have functions and information that other controls do not have, so you should always check the result. 
MazaCam will display, if appropriate, various warnings to help you identify things you particularly need to look at after converting. As always, the operator is responsible for checking the results and for the safe operation of the equipment.